Yo guys, boys and girls, it is Keralis and welcome back to El Minecrafto and the Minecraft vehicle tutorial series with Keralis, that's me and today we're gonna build a police car SUV or a police SUV, alright? As you can see down here we got two bad guys, no, one bad guy, <laughs> two police cars, what a derp, <laughs> chasing that bad guy, alright? And up ahead I'm gonna build a roadblock using the police SUV police car SUV, designed by Mr. Fruity Tree, and I'm gonna use Rudo Place here just because we can, it's gonna be brighter and easier to see. So, guys, you ready? Placing the rear wheels, they're gonna be looking something like this. You can't fail this. If you fail this, skip to the next video, right? Now, jump away five blocks, and on the fifth one, place the front wheels. So now, it's looking something like this. We got a gap by four blocks in between the front and the rear wheels. In between those, let's add a platform using quartz slabs, which goes like this on the back. On the front, it will be looking like that. So from above, we got this little shape going. You with me? Perfect. Now, I'm gonna use black stained clay. For those who kinda hate black stained clay look in the default texture pack, use just black wool, alright? I'm gonna place them here. I'm gonna jump away and place two more here. So from above, it looks like that now, and I'm gonna place them on the back here as well. So from above, we got this little shape going. Mm -hmm. With full blocks of quartz, place them three from the front and one on the back. So from above, we got this little shape going. You can't fail, this is super easy. Now, take some quartz stairs and place them upside down in this little shape. Do the same on the other side. Poop and poop, like that. What goes for the rims? You know what? This will be this will be cool looking. So let's add those little little rims here with the iron thing in the inside, right? So iron frame, block of iron. Iron frame, block of iron. Can you see how badass this is starting to look? Amazing. Using your window penises, just put one here and one on the other side. So we got that little thing going. Perfect. Now what goes for the inside of the car? I'm just gonna use, this This is a car which is just for looks, all right? So we're gonna use a seating, we're gonna have a little front wheel here, and the rest of the cabin or the drive, you know, the, the cabin, you call them cabin, right? We're just gonna place glass like that. So free, so from above the wheel into the empty space in the back, three blocks of glass. On the back, quartz stairs and quartz stairs, Upside down stairs on this side and the same on the other side. Now, I'm just gonna place this for now. Place one more upside down stair on this side. So now we have a little shape there, which is supposed to be like a little window, right? And I'm gonna do the same on this side. So just boop. So now we got that shape going. Around the whole front thing, we're just gonna use slabs. In this little thing. Snap. This is looking awesome. I love it. So. Perfecto El Mundo. Next step is daylight sensor on the back, just for the looks, all right? So I'm gonna put it up here. We're gonna use some redstone comparators and we're gonna put them here. And on the back ones here, we're just gonna put some antennas in the shape of levers. What is love? Baby, don't hurt me. I'm gonna add a tripwire hook on this side a tripwire hook on this side, just for the looks of it. Bananas. All right, on the front, I'm gonna use a weighted pleasure plate on this, which kind of resembles maybe an engine or just a hood of the car or something. Doesn't really matter, just for the looks, all right? On the front, I'm gonna use poop and poop. <laughs> I don't frame, it's the poop, all right? And a redstone lamp on, in both of them. As a little grill, let's just use the ladder, bam. And as a little spoiler thing, not a spoiler, what you call them? You know this thing. I don't know what you call it in English, but you know what I mean. I mean, you know what? In the middle one here, we can just write Keralis Police Department. And this is the third car, so KPD free. I'm going to do the same on the back. So let's see here. Here, KPD number three, because we already got two police cars over there, right? So one here and one here. Just look how cool this looks. All right. Backlights, just gonna use redstone, block of redstones. Well, I had it. There we go. Poop and poop. 
This, ladies and gentlemen, it's pretty much done dealio. We got our little police car SUV and just take a look at this. What we could also do in this, we could add some redstone as we did on other cars, which is which the flashing lights and everything, but I'm not gonna do that. I'm just gonna leave this standing here. What I can do though, is maybe place some, oops, redstone torches on the ground, just to, you know, kind of represent that it's, dude, do not come here, this is a roadblock, do not go here. Even though, you know, roadblock using <laughs> just redstone torches. You could put fencing, right? But you know what I mean, just for the looks of it, just for the demonstration, just for the, for the cool effect, and I love it. So guys, you know what, don't be shy, hit that like button if you did enjoy, and build this yourselves. I'm gonna use, I'm gonna check the Mr. Meep texture pack, or shares mod. It looks absolutely love. And options, resource packs, default. Nah, it kinda looks alright. I kinda like it, you know. Bam. You know, this doesn't do much, but it adds. It kind of gives you the cool little feeling and get some inspiration from it. And you know what it is, right? It's a police car SUV. Bananas in pajamas. Re Replace shaders. Just awesome. So guys, thank you for watching. Don't be shy, hit that like button, and I will see you in the next one. Diamonds and love and all the cool stuff. This is Keralis signing off from the Minecraft V Cold Tutorial Series. Take care and see you in the next one. Bye bye.